Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryda Matoro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like the video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, now before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters of this YouTube channel. A big shout out to Wii's GNZ Gaming, Maori Superman YT and even Foxy. Now these people are our YouTube members on our YouTube platform and I really do appreciate their support. So why don't you go inside my description below and go check them out and we're going to get straight into the video now this video is all about on how to install Gabriella inside your Grand Theft Auto e folder so like always make sure that you download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below once you have completed that process then download this mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below this mod does require add-on pads, so I'll leave this inside my description below as well. So make sure that you download add-on pads. Now this does require ped selector, so I'll leave this inside my description below as well. There will be a zip file and a RAR file as well, so choose which one you prefer. And next, make sure that you do download native UI as well. I have already got native UI already installed, so you guys will need to install it yourself. First things first, let's go to our Grand Theft Auto B game. Hover over it, right click, and open file location. Next, go to your mods folder, go to your update folder, go to time 64, then go to your DLC packs folder. Next, open up your add-on PEDS extract folder. Then go to your DLC packs folder. Then go to your add-on PEDS and drag that folder inside your DLC packs folder. Go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder. Then go to your Scots folder. And then now open up your PEDS selector extract folder. Select that file and drag it inside your Scots folder. Then go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder. Exit out of your PEDS selector extract folder. Now go back to your add-on PEDS extract folder. Then go back to the main page. Next, select your add-on PEDS VAS.xml and add-on PEDS editor.exe. Drag both files inside your Grand Theft Auto V main folder. Next, open up your readme.html. Then just keep scrolling down until you see the DRC packs line. Copy this line and now minimize that and exit out of your add on PEDS extract folder. Now open up your open IV, go to Grand Theft Auto V, and now go to your mods folder, go to update, go to update.rpf, go to common, go to data, then scroll right down to the bottom until you see drclist.xml. Remember to go to edit mode, and select yes. Go to your DRC list.xml, right click, select edit, then scroll right down to the bottom, and now make sure that you add the code inside here. Then save. Now go back to your GTA V, and we will need to get back in here again later on. Now we have fully finished installing add-on PEDS. Now we need to install the Gabriella mod. Open up your Gabriella extract folder. Go to your folder over here. 
then go to stream. Now you will need to install these files inside your OpenIV. So go to OpenIV, go to mods, go to update, go to time 64, go to DRC packs, then go to add on pads, then go to drc.rpf, then go to pads.rpf. So all you got to do now is just select all of your Gabriella files and drag it inside your open library like that. Now next, go to your edit mode, go to GTA V and exit out of your open library. Now next, go and grab one file and drag it to your desktop and exit out of your extract folder. Go to your file, right click, go to rename and copy that name and now you can delete that now and now go to your add-on peds editor.exe right click and run as administrator now once your add-on peds editor has popped up all you gotta do is go to your peds drop down menu select new ped and i'll paste your model name right there ped type female is streamed false then go to add ped now one more go to rebuild select ok then exit out of your add-on ped editor and now all you got to do next is right click refresh your game folder exit out of your game folder right click refresh your desktop and now we have finished installing add-on peds mod and even the gabriella mod now, unfortunately, it is a long process, but um, it is really easy to install these mods, okay guys? So, we're going to go and test out the mod, and I'll see you guys in the game. And now we are back in the game with Franklin. So, as you guys can see, that my game did not crash. So, once you're in the game, all you gotta do is press your L key on your keyboard. And now you'll see Ped Selector. Go to add on pins and then now select Gabriella. And then there you go, there she is. If you want to change your clothes, you can use any uh, menu like menu or whatever, but I always use menu. So press F8 once and then I press F8 again. Then go to play options, then go to wardrobe and then go to front view to see the whole view of your. Uh, model now you can go over here now. I think most of these don't work. Okay But uh, I think shoes is to change the eye color Yeah, that's the shoes and go over here. That's what this will give you the necklace uh, Accessories will give you the glasses you can give the glasses the armor will give you nothing. Emblem will give you nothing as well. Now the top will change the whole outfit like that. So basically it's only two outfits. It's pretty convenient, but yeah. Uh, to change the hairstyle, I think it is hands and back, yeah. Hands and back. Uh, boldy, but yeah. So yeah, this mod 100% works. I just wish that the mod owner would like add more clothing and hairstyles, but it's really cool and I really do enjoy the mod. So the mod does work 100%. So I hope you guys do enjoy the mod. And we're back again, so I hope you guys do enjoy the mod. Now, like what I said before, it is a long process to install the mod if you're not using add-on pens, okay? So I hope you guys do enjoy the mod. But if you guys do get stuck installing this mod, then please let me know in the comments. And I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that. Or if you do get stuck installing any other mods from GTA V or Cyberpunk, then let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that. Now... I am not active inside my YouTube comments, 
So if you need fast reply or if you need help quick, then go to my Discord server. I will leave my Discord server link inside my description below and make sure you join the PC modding support server. So make sure that you do that, okay? So you can get fast help and reply from me. So with that all said, if you guys did enjoy this video or if the video was helpful, please smash that like button and subscribe for more content and tutorials. And I'll see you all on my next video. Thank you for watching. Peace and I'm out.